Viral Science, the home of creativity. Hey friends, welcome back. In this video, I'll show you how to use a NRF 24LO1 trans receiver module to control your relays, lights via remote switches. So let's get started with this video. This video is sponsored by JLC PCB. JLC PCB is one of the lead manufacturers of PCBs at very low prices. So just add your Gerber files over here and select the quantity, select the color and place your orders. So this PCB looks very professional, neat and clean for your projects. So you can order your PCBs from JLC PCB. So to make this project you will need two Arduinos, one for transmitter and one for receiver. Two NRF 24LO1 trans receiver module. I have made this connector so I can plug it on a breadboard. You will need a relay module. These are two switches on and off. Then you will need a 10K resistors. You will need two breadboards, some wires and a battery. Now follow this circuit diagram and connect your trans receiver module with Arduino. This connection will be same for transmitter and receiver. Now we'll connect a relay module to this circuit diagram and this complete module will become the receiver part of the project. So I have connected everything according to the circuit diagram and our receiver part of the project is ready. So now we'll proceed to the transmitter section. So in this we'll be connecting two switches, two resistors to our Arduino board. So now follow this circuit diagram to complete your transmitter connections. So according to the circuit diagram, I have also completed the transmitter connections. So you can see the connection is a bit messy, but it works. So now we'll connect our Arduino board with the computer and open the code. On the left side, you can see the code for the receiver part and on the right side, you will see the code for the transmitter part. So we'll upload code one by one to our both of the Arduinos. One will be the transmitter and one will be the receiver. So to upload the code, you just need to select a board that is Arduino Nano. Select the port, select the processor as old bootloader and upload the code. So first I'm uploading the code to the transmitter Arduino board. So after uploading the code, remove the transmitter Arduino board and connect the receiver part. In the receiver Arduino board, upload the second code. So here I have a 2 pin AC connector connected with the bulb socket and I have cut one of its wire. Now we'll connect the, both the ends of this wire to the relay module and relay will act as a switch to turn on and off. It will complete the circuit and it will break the circuit. Be very careful while doing this connection because we are using very high voltages. You can even take help of an electrician while doing this. So now our project is ready and we will test it out. So as you can see when I turn on the first switch the relay one turns on and it turns on the bulb as well. 
So now I'm turning on the second switch, but I've not connected any bulb to it, but you can see the LED glows on the relay module. In the upcoming project, I'm going to make a joystick controller with this trans receiver module. So stay tuned and subscribe to my channel. So friends, I hope you like this project and do hit that like button, share this video with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos. And I will see you in the next one. Do subscribe and press bell icon to get instant notification for new video.